Welcome to the Week in Trek. I'm Dan Gunther. Let's get right to the news from Star Trek this week. Some encouraging words about Star Trek Beyond this week from actor John Cho, the new continuity's Hikaru Sulu. Speaking to Famous Monsters magazine as part of a special 50th anniversary of Star Trek issue, Cho had this to say about writers Doug Young and Simon Pegg. What you're going to get when you ask Simon Pegg to pen a script is a very human touch, and a warm touch, and that can come out in comedy, but doesn't necessarily have to. And there are some funny moments. But I think he and co-writer Doug Young, from what I could tell, were constantly looking for connections between the characters. And that, from the cast perspective, was what was spectacular about asking Simon and Doug to do it. It just felt like they were looking for human moments. Cho also had this to say about the film and how he feels it captures the spirit of TOS. When I read the script, my emotional impression was that it felt very much like the best of the original series. It felt like the series felt to me and the first film that we made didn't entirely feel like that to me. Now, understandably, an actor wants the buzz around the film to be positive, so take what he has to say with a grain of salt. However, I really like the positivity of this, and I certainly hope that it bodes well for Star Trek Beyond. Do you like the idea of galactic domination? Well, you can indulge that craving in the Star Trek universe soon, thanks to Risk the Star Trek edition. Coming in June, this new take on the game of hurt feelings and recrimination will make your game night a lot of fun, especially if you combine it with my favorite, Star Trek Tan. Captain Kirk, how dare you authorize a mere two men for a project of this importance? Starfleet Command. I have never this. questioned the orders or the intelligence of any representative of the Federation. Until now. And in sadder news today, actor William Schallert, probably best known for his role as the father in the Patty Duke show, died at his home in Pacific Palisades, California. He was 93 years old. Star Trek fans will probably best remember him as Nils Barris, the officious Federation representative in the fan favorite, The Trouble with Tribbles. He also had a guest starring role in the Deep Space Nine episode Sanctuary, in which he played a Bajoran musician named Verani. He is survived by four sons and seven grandchildren. Starship. <laughs> That's supposed to mean it flies through space. That's right. That isn't possible. Only in books. H.G. Wells, Jules Verne. Maybe if you saw it, you'd think otherwise. For the first time since the 1990s, Star Trek novels will be released as audiobooks. This year's Legacies trilogy, celebrating the 50th anniversary of Star Trek, will be released as unabridged audiobooks. They will feature the voice talents of Robert Petkoff. Petkoff began recording Captain to Captain by Greg Cox, the first book in the trilogy, on May 11th, with the remaining two novels to follow. This is exciting news for fans who have wanted Star Trek audiobooks for quite some time now. Hopefully the sales of these books will warrant a continuation of this by pocketbooks. On the Literary Treks podcast this week, Bruce Gibson, Matthew Rushing, and I discuss an odd comic crossover, Star Trek and the Legion of Superheroes. A link in the description if you'd like to give that one a listen. Before I go, I'd like to say a really big thank you to all of you who have subscribed and liked the videos in the last few weeks. We just recently passed 50 subscribers, which is awesome. Uh, although I do have to admit, as a Star Trek fan, I was a little bit more giddy when we passed 47. We're trying a lot of different things on this channel, including Three Nerds Review, in which we review a number of new movies coming out over the course of this year. Check out those videos. Again, thank you so much for watching, liking, subscribing, all the things you guys do. If you'll excuse me, I'm off to watch Deadpool. Uh, if you haven't seen our review of that yet, you should check it out.